Well, good afternoon, folks. It's Joe here from Tango Spice, back in the test kitchen. So last night we had some friends over, and we did a shrimp boil. You know, the kind of boil you have potatoes and corn, sausage, shrimp, cauliflower. It was really, really good. Now, naturally, we over bought some shrimp, so we'd have some leftover shrimp. We have leftover corn, and uh, hey, let's find something to do with a little bit of leftovers. And it is a rare thing having leftover shrimp, so let's make a shrimp and cucumber salad. A little bit spicy, let's give it a shot. Let's take a look at the ingredients. What we do have is we have one pound of the 2125 shrimps. We boiled them yesterday and then last night we peeled them, took the tails off. This is just nice ice cold shrimp meat that we boiled up in some good spicy stuff. This will make a nice salad. Of course, some jalapenos. We need some limes and uh, some of the corn that we shaved off the cob that was in that boil as well. And we're gonna use some red onion. Naturally, a little bit of cilantro. Gotta have cilantro, man. And a cucumber. Take that, a little English cucumber. And of course, we're gonna season it with our Cajun rub. That's what we did the shrimp boiling last night. We. Uh, had a big pot of water, put a pound of Cajun rub in there and cooked up all this good stuff. A little bit of leftovers. Let's make a nice salad for tonight. So welcome to Tango Spice on YouTube. Now one of the first things we're going to want to do is take the shrimp. And uh, this ends up being a difficult process because the shrimp is so good. You just want to take it, dip it in some cocktail sauce and eat it. But what we're going to do is we're just going to cut it in half like that crosswise we just want a, some more bite-sized pieces a couple of them will probably end up doing in thirds you know like that just so we have some nice small pieces to deal with in the salad we have one pound of these shrimps the rest of them we just sort of chowed on so uh let me get these chopped up and we'll continue so there ends up uh, one pound of the boiled shrimps i did end up cutting most of them up into thirds just to make a nice a nice bite-sized piece. So, and then we're just going to add one cup of the kernels of corn that we took off the corn on the cob. That was also in the boil as well. You can still smell the spices from last night's boil. Now let's cut up the cucumber and add that. Remember, non-reactive bowl. We'll be using some uh, lime juice later. Now let's dice up this cucumber. It has seeds. Take a lot of the seeds out. And uh, I'm going to skin just part of it. I like the crunchiness of the skin. So uh, in about sugar cube sizes. So let's get to chopping. So let's just take a little bit of the, uh, the skin off the outside of parts of this cucumber. I'm going to leave some of it on there. And here's about the size of the dice we want for these. Something like that. That's really good. Then we'll just add this to the shrimp and the corn. We get the corn and the shrimp and just add the cucumber. Start to come together. Add with the corn, the cucumber, the shrimp. We'll add a quarter cup of chopped red onions. I like them big because I want that crunch. I love red onions. Now, let's mix up the dressing. Need juice for two of these limes. So give it a good mash. What the heck? Now let's mix up the dressing for the shrimp and cucumber salad. Uh, we juiced the two limes, so we just pour that in there to make sure we didn't have the seeds. I don't need that today. I'm using Frank's hot sauce, any kind of Louisiana style hot sauce. Oh, take that cap off. We want to be able to pour it. But really, any kind of Louisiana style, you just want it. Yeah, non, non chunky style. Now, again, we're going to use the. Whoa, that's too close. We'll use the Cajun rub because when we were doing the seafood boil yesterday with the shrimp and the corn, we used the Cajun rub. Oh, about a teaspoon, maybe, maybe a little bit more. What the heck? Incorporate that real nice. Then we have well, about a quarter cup of, oops, that was no good. A quarter cup of chopped cilantro. 
mix that with a spoon because it gets stuck in the whisk. Check that out. That's really gosh darn nice. So now what I got to do now is we're going to add probably about three tablespoons or so of olive oil. Put a little bit in there. Mix it up. Up to about three tablespoons. Then we'll finish putting this together. Spicy shrimp and cucumber salad. Tango spice style. Well, so in this bowl we have the shrimp, the cucumber, the red onion, and the corn. And the shrimp and the corn was from yesterday's shrimp boil. So let's just add the dressing now. Give that a little mix. Tell you what. I am a huge fan of cilantro. I'm digging it. Yeah, not too bad, right? Check it out. So we're gonna do, we're gonna put this in the fridge for about an hour. I want this thing nice and chilled. So leftover shrimp from a shrimp boil with the corn off the cob that we shaved off the cob from the shrimp boil. And that, uh, cause you have the, the flavors of that plus the cilantro and a little vinaigrette we made with more of our Cajun spice. So there it is. That's how it looks so far the shrimp and cucumber spicy salad hey it's tango style so there you have it folks a really simple crisp cool salad for a summer day I had the shrimp from the shrimp boil the corn from the shrimp boil off the cob slice off the cob added some red onions some cilantro and a nice big english cucumber and i'll tell you what this stuff is really good give it a shot give it a try oh wait wait Yeah, there you go. Put it next to a really nice steak. Put it in the bowl by itself. You don't need anything else. Nice, cool summer salad. Spicy cucumber and shrimp salad here on Tango Spice. Have a great week. Solancha.